Hi, I'm Barry here from um, Wirecop in Richmond. Today I'm gonna talk you through how to make the turmeric spice chicken roll. At Wirecop here we serve Indonesian influence food in a sandwich form. So I'm gonna start to make a pickle garnish. We have carrot, daikon. So you wanna cut it the size of the matchsticks. It doesn't matter if, if the size is different, but just try to keep it all the same for the texture. So ideally you make this pickling liquid the day before, or you can always make it on the day. Just leave it for at least three hours. And then there's some paper here that I put on the top. All your vegetables will stay under the pickle liquid. Now we need to make the spice mix. All you need to do is just chop all these vegetables, turmeric, galangal, ginger, garlic, and then put it in the spice grinder or a blender to make like a paste. Fry the paste off for about five to eight minutes. And once you get the dark yellow color, then you know it's done. So now we're gonna cook the chicken. The coconut cream will tenderize the chicken and will add a creaminess flavor to it. Similar to when people use buttermilk to marinate their chicken. We bring it up to the boil and then we turn it off and we leave it, sort of slow cook it for half an hour. All these herbs, which is tarragon, chives, dill and coriander, it's just gonna add lots of flavors and lots of freshness. Once your vegetables pickle, you can dry it off with a paper towel. And then now with the rest of the sauce, you can put some in so it's become almost like a dressing. You can cut it inside, just not all the way through, so you can keep the filling inside. So I'm gonna use the brie pink peppercorn cheese today. It's creamy, it's uh, light, quite peppery, so you get the sweet and the spiciness to it as well. So now you have your turmeric spice chicken roll. Very good.